Hello, John Talley here with Boats.net. Hey, is it time to replace the controlled cables on your boat? Well, listen, I've been looking at a company called Multiflex, and I've been pretty impressed with their product. So let's go over to the table. And let me show you what I found out about them. All right, as you can tell on this table, I've got a couple of different scenarios lined up. I mean, this is the perfect world over here where there's a nice smooth curve and everything's great. Well, guess what? That really doesn't translate to what happens in a boat. Honestly, this is what really happens when you're trying to bend the cable through all those turns to get from the control all the way back to the motor. So what we're gonna do is take a force meter and we're gonna take a look at each cable side by side and we're gonna take a force measurement in just foot pounds and we're looking for the peak. It really wouldn't matter what unit, we're just looking for a comparison because what we have in each scenario is both the multiflex cable and just the standard cable. So we're gonna pull both of them all the way out. I'm gonna keep a consistent rate going in and see what they measure. I'm gonna stop a little bit short so it doesn't bottom out. We'll start with the multiflex cable. 0.237 pounds, so almost nothing. All right, let's zero it out and take a look at our other cable. All right, 1.9, so pretty drastic difference. All right, now for fun, let's see what happens when you throw some curves into the equation. We'll do the standard first. Big difference. Four and a half pounds. Now, let's see what the multiflex does. I can already tell you just from pulling it that it will be substantially less. Barely over a pound, 1.1. So huge difference in between the two. Now looking beyond the actual peak numbers, what I noticed immediately is the linear feel on the multiflex cable. As you're pushing in, it's the same amount of pressure all the way through the stroke. And with a linear feel like that, it's going to translate to a very smooth, controlled throttle response at your helm. On the other cable, it starts off okay, then it starts to get tighter, 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 and tighter. Now, that's going to translate to a really sluggish control, especially on your throttle. It's going to start out good and just start tensing up. Chances are it's not going to go all the way through the stroke, and that's what you don't want when you're trying to get wide open throttle. Now these are not the only cables that Multiflex deals with. They also deal with steering controls, whether they be mechanical or hydraulic. They carry the entire line, no matter what type of controls you need for your boat. Speaking of that, if you do need control cables for your boat, why don't you come see us at boats.net pick out what you need, and if you're not quite sure it's exactly right for your application, give us a call. We'll be glad to make sure and verify that you're getting the right product for your particular application. Well, I've got the cables that I need, so I'm about to go get to work. Well, listen, if you want to keep up with what I'm doing next, hit that subscribe button. Till the next time, we just want to say thanks for shopping here with us at Boats.net. If you have any questions or comments, leave them in the section below. I'll do my best to answer them. Until next time, we just want to say thanks for watching. We will see you out on the water.